Hello everyone, it's Joanna, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, thanks for clicking on the link. I post videos about plus size fashion, I do beauty reviews from the perspective of someone who is visually impaired like me, colorblind, um, so I look at things that are for makeup for glasses but not like super duper makeup for glasses because I can't see um so yeah I film hauls like from home bargains B&M I have a playlist uh Primark Poundland these are the shops that I like going to and filming hauls um and yeah I do planner videos sometimes so if that's what you enjoy please consider subscribing to my channel now um, let me tell you a little bit about myself. I'm a teacher and I'm 46. Uh, I turned 46 on January the 8th. I don't know when the when this video is going to go up, so probably I'll be 46 when you watch this. Now, I love watching empties videos because you get the person's true view on something. So that's why I love filming them. I love watching them. Great for recommendations. I don't have a lot of products. I have about like eight so you won't need a full glass of coffee, a few, a full glass, a full cup of coffee, probably just half a glass. Half a cup! Ugh. Anyway, so let's begin. A product that I really liked is from Rituals. It was a shower foam and it's, oh, it's got lotus and uh, white tea. This does not create a foam that you would get like... Uh, a cloud kind of foam where you're shaving it creates a foamy kind of texture but it's like um more like a balm balm in between something like that so don't expect you're going to do this and you're going to get a big cloudy kind of foam you don't it, it it smells on your body it's like a spa experience i really like this i have bought uh, repurchased minis of this my favorite ritual scent are the karma scent and the ayurveda something like that which is rose so these two are my favorite scents really like it recommend it start with a mini see if you like the texture i liked it so that's something that I used up and was really pleased with. Another product that is probably in all my <laughs> empties because I just go through these a lot is the Age Rewind Make I Rewind. I Age Rewind. Anyway, the Eraser by Maybelline. You know this. You've seen this. Everyone uses it. I use this under the eyes when I have a full face of makeup on or I just use it a little bit under the eyes and just correct where I have pigmentation. I love this. I've repurchased it many, many times. I use this for no makeup days sometimes and just put a little bit of this and that's it. And then I put on the rest of my face. So if you haven't tried this, I would recommend. If you can find your shade, go for it. Um, quite affordable. I mentioned this in my previous empties, but I had a little bit in, so I wanted to give this a shout out because I loved it. I have two products from the line Fresh. I really like their products. They are actually fresh. They feel nice uh, and hydrating on the face. So number one that I finished, and it's going to go in the bin now, is the Fresh Rose uh, Deep Hydration, Hydration Sleeping Mask, which replenishes and locks hydration. I put this on at night. It had a gel and a cream, especially during the summer. This was great because my skin felt tight and I would put this on and I would wake up in the morning and it would feel really plump and refreshed just love this product I will repurchase this for sure I'm not going to purchase it now because I've got to go through other products I'm going to put it on my to buy list uh, for when I run out of sleeping masks um, to purchase Another product from Fresh, which I really liked and I just finished, is the, what's it called? This is called Lotus Youth Preserve Moisturizer. I finished this. I had a mini. I really enjoyed this. This it has antioxidants and is very uh, refreshing and hydrating and just smoothens out your skin if you have like little sticky outed bits of skin uh, that need exfoliating but rough patches. I really enjoyed this. Again, this is going to go on my to buy list but not at the moment because I have lots of moisturizers and products that I got for Christmas so not going to repurchase it now but 
if you haven't tried it maybe try a mini because you can get minis from look fantastic as well so maybe check that out a product that I have repurchased many times I'm not going to repurchase at the moment because I again I have other products is the boots glow this smells like watermelon it feels great it's cold and you put it on in the morning and you feel awake it's it's a kind of thicker liquid so you do feel it's making your skin like hydrated and uh, plumper so if you haven't tried this this is quite affordable this is like four pounds I think so you can you can try this it's great I loved it I repurchased it many times I'm not going to repurchase it now because I have other products that I'm trying to use up um, from the Philip Kingsley shampoo line, I used the bodybuilding shampoo and conditioning. I love this product. The thing about the shampoo is when you wash your hair, it does not make your hair feel soft. So I think this is just stripping from dirt and stuff. And then um, you need to go in with the conditioner to you to feel nice and soft. I don't have the condition I chucked the box with the bottle, but I did the tube, but I did use it up. I used both up. This was my second one. I really like it. It does give a volume. I love the Philip Kingsley elasticizer line. So if you haven't tried that, give it a give it a try. I have a backup of this, but I'm using the Redken color magnetic at the moment and I think oh, don't hear this. I prefer the red can so I have a backup which I'm gonna use but I think I like the red can more it does give body volume so if you've tried the red can and you like it maybe give this one a try as well you're looking to try something else because you're supposed to change your shampoos as well this was sent to me to try and I did try it and I did like it it's the Mila Simone vitamin C serum with hyaluronic acid I liked this I got this this was sent from Amazon it's one of their best sellers I liked it it was a great vitamin serum I've had it for vitamin C serum I've had it for a while I used most of it up then I got a different vitamin C so I stopped using it it didn't make my skin tingle which is great and it did feel hydrating so if you're looking to try a vitamin c maybe read about this one on amazon i used up a primer the elf poreless putty primer these are great they are like butter you put it on your face it smooths your face great canvas to put on then your foundation this helps keep my foundation in place for quite a while which is why I like it I have repurchased this many times I use this more in the winter time and autumn because it is quite thick and I don't want this to be it's in the summertime I use something lighter this is a thick one great though great product um, the foundation that I always use I emptied Born to Glow, it's what I'm wearing at the moment, it's from NYX, I'm in the uh, shade Vanilla, it is a great product if you want glowy skin, it is quite liquidy, it is quite long lasting, it doesn't stick to dry patches, I think it tries to smooth them out, so if you have a little bit of texture, it might you might see it on the texture, but it's also trying to soften it, I think that's what I've, because I usually get a little bit of dry skin here, and it's fine, um, really like it, have repurchased it, used it throughout the year, great product, if you haven't tried it, try it from the next pack counter. Finally, a deodorant, which I always purchase from Greece, and I bring it when I come to the UK, is the Neutral Roberts Delicate Powder Fresh um, deodorant. This makes my... Uh, it, it smells really nice. It smells like a powder, like a talc, but it's not a talc. Um, and it, when I'm wearing this, it's not stinky, <laughs> even if you sweat. It's fine. So really, I have a backup of this. I also got the Wild um, Echo Friendly deodorant, which I'm going to use. So I haven't opened my backup. I'm going to use the Wild one. And then we're going to see if I prefer the Wild one. Then I'm probably going to stop using this. And I'm first going to finish it. But yeah, 
So these were the products that I finished. Have you tried any of these products? What do you think? Do you have a standout empty? Please let me know. Please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps uh, my channel get views and leave a comment. Subscribe if you want to. It would be great to have you in this little group. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.